Right, here is the finished honey sizer. As you can see, the starting gravity is 1110. Um, I've got me table upstairs so I'll have to work out what the uh, the um, what the percentages that it'll come out I'll write it in the description below but that's a recipe I loosely used instead of Waitrose I used Lidl's apple juice um, I used more honey than that I used 900 grams of honey um, I used 400 grams of light brown sugar um, I used pectolase I use citric acid instead of uh, malactic. Um, I did the tea. I also inst I used one packet of cider yeast, and I put one te uh, teaspoon of new yeast nutrient. So uh, this is it. Basically, ten to fifteen minutes later, nothing's happened. It's a lovely dark colour at the minute. That's to do with the tea and the brown sugar at the moment uh, but the apple juice was cloudy anyway um, nothing going on with the airlock at the moment um, what I'm gonna do and in a minute I'm going to going to bottle up the first hopped cherry cider. Um, I bottled up two bottles of wine that I had in a demijohn, um, which are there, which is white grape wine. Um, so there you go. That one's a bit cloudy. I've got a. I just poured tip the remainder in a bottle. I'll drink that bit. And um, yeah, it's looking quite good. And that's my black, or my red, I should say. So.